Hey there everybody, and welcome to the channel, I'm your host, Rama, and this week in Grand Theft Auto Online, you are going to be earning double money on security contracts. There were a couple people asking in my comment section why I didn't post a weekly update, and that is because I was literally dying with some sort of sickness. I took a COVID test, it wasn't COVID, I actually took two COVID tests, just to be sure, and it wasn't COVID, but um, all I can say is that I'm still recovering from whatever I had, and uh, yeah, so that's why I didn't get my weekly update. Thankfully, I had two videos pre-recorded that I posted, but today, we are taking a look at security contracts, and that is because this week, they are double money. Take a look at that, $125,000 to recover valuables. That is an absolutely massive chunk. Recovering valuables takes, what, five, six minutes to do? And we're gonna make 120 grand for that? I mean, that is absolutely insane. And the best part about security contracts for the agency is that each five you complete gives you $500 towards your passive income. So for any of you that haven't been participating with the agency, have not been claiming your passive income, this would be the week to do so. Every time that a week comes out with security contracts, I complete them. I'm pretty close to getting the max income, which is $20,000 every 48 minutes. I'm pretty close. Right now, I'm probably at about 15,000, but I still need to finish a couple more here and there. So I think that's what I'll do this week. And totally need to complete 200 security contracts to get the maximum bonus, which really isn't that bad, to be completely honest. All right, so let's see what we can do here. We're gonna land at the Tequila La. I think that's how you pronounce it. I think we can enter the back, if I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong. But we're gonna up, we're gonna miss the stairs is what's gonna happen. Alright, let's try. I'm gonna pull out, yeah, we'll use an assault shotgun. That should get the job done. Yes, we can enter the back. Okay. Locate the safe. Well, first things first, we're gonna murder a bunch of people. Hello, good sir. Hello, ma'am. Hello, good sir. Oh, well, you're all dead. Oh, we already found the safe. Well, that was pretty easy. I know a couple spots of where the safe code can be. Oh, my. Okay. Okay, that was, that's on me. I'll, I'll admit to that one. It doesn't really matter if you die, is the good news. Um, let's just make our way through the front really quick now. Now that we've cleared the back area. Oh, wait, can we not go through the front or is it the other door? Wait, I think it's this door. It is. Okay. Oh, no, you don't. No, you don't. Okay, maybe, maybe you do. Maybe you do. Uh, you gone. You gone. Let's just eat some snacks real quick so we don't die. All right. And you know what? There's a, there's a simple solution to this. Uh, we'll just throw a grenade in there. Oh, no! No, that's not what I wanted! Crap! 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 Oh, my rat! Oh, my rat! Okay, you're dead. <laughs> you're dead. Bro, there ain't no way this strat worked. I threw grenades and now... <laughs> this is great. Uh, these, these are the moments I enjoy, GTA, when random things happen. Alright, well, I'm still looking for the code. I don't see it anywhere on the front desk here, which is, a uh, one spot that it can be at. It can be over here as well. Oh, there it is. Let's see. Collect the safe combination. Ah, uh, thank you. All right, now we're going to go head back upstairs. Let's just get these losers real quick. There you go. There you go. I forgot that more people come over here. Uh, let's exit the building, and then we can just enter through the back. I honestly think that's a faster way to do this. Speed is key. Go, 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 and up we go. All right, that was pretty easy. And then we can just run right through here, and the safe is right around the corner. Nice. Okay. So just like that, we've completed the job. All right, we have exited the tequila la. Let's just honestly steal this motorcycle. We only have to go like one mile as it is. So let's just go full speed ahead. Yeah, baby. This was honestly really fast to complete though. This took me about four minutes. That's it. I mean, that's really, really easy. Four minutes for $125,000. I mean, that is a flat stinking dub. I would highly recommend that any of you who are not participating in security contracts, and if you definitely don't own the agency, buy one. It's such a good business. First of all, you have Amani Tech vehicles, which you can upgrade, give you big chunks of survivability in public sessions, especially if you're doing sale missions or anything like that. But even better than Amani Tech vehicles are just all the different ways you can make money with the agency. It is by far one of the most effective passive and aggressive businesses for, or not aggressive, but active businesses is what I should say. So there you go. That was fairly fast. Took me four minutes and 30 seconds to complete. And there you go. Hello, Franklin. Thank you for the $125,000.
while waiting for the cooldown of like three minutes for that job, we're just going to make our way over to do a payphone hit. It's very unfortunate Rockstar nerfed payphone hits. What is it like a 40 minute cooldown now instead of what used to be a 15 minute cooldown? It's really, really disappointing. But thankfully, payphone hits are still very, very easy to complete and super duper fast. So let's do a payphone hit make another $85,000 and super, super fast. We got to use a scoped rifle to blow up the engine of the target's car while they are inside of it. This one's a bit annoying because we do have to wait three minutes just to do nothing, essentially, because the person's not going to leave until three minutes. I wish they made it like one minute because seriously, how long is it going to take somebody to get over to the destination? But either way, let's get over there. Oh my god, she's just running, bruh. Why is she running? I don't know, maybe he did some nasty things. Either way, we're waiting for this guy to enter his car. And... bye bye Oh boy, that was a, a very hard payphone hit, you know? So much effort had to be put into that. Anyway, now we have to leave the area. I'm so glad I waited three minutes on the roof of a building. But you know what? We got $85,000 for that, so I really can't complain. Ain't no way, bruh. It wants me to do another Tequila La mission. All right, that's it. I didn't want to have to do it, but we're pulling it out. Oh, sorry. Wrong, wrong door. Wrong door. We're pulling it out. The stone hatchet. Uh, <laughs> that did not work. We just need to get one kill with the stone hatchet. That's all we need. One kill and we will become Omni-Man. All right, uh, not this way. All right, come over here. I need, I need to put some armor on. One kill. Yes, that's what we needed. We are now Rambo. Come over here, good sir. Come over here, madam. Oh my god, right into her head. All right, let's jump off so we can get uh, some more use of this ability. How you doing? Goodbye. Thank you. And a goodbye. Yeah, I always recommend to use the hatchet if you can. It's just such a good weapon to pick up kills with. I just wish you didn't have to go through that, that like, axe to the head animation. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, wait, I'm too fat to fit through here. There we go. Goodbye. Mm, that was very challenging. Ooh, I really, I really struggled with this one. Is there somebody in here? Oh, yep, yes, there is. Come over here. Ah, goodbye. <laughs> oh, that's great. All right, we got to find the safe combination. Is it in the same spot as before? No, it's not. Okay. Uh, it's not on the, oh, no, it's right there on the table. Okay. Well, that's pretty easy. It is 0502, and I don't know what the rest is. All right, well, we ran out of our, our axe ability, so let's just bonk you in the head. Oh, no, you don't. No, you don't. Bonk. All right, there we go. It looks like the safe is once again upstairs. I, oh, I guess the stairs are right here. I didn't even know where the stairs were. Die! Okay, we're good. Up this, nope, that's not the stairs. All right, you know what? I'm going to do what I did last time and just enter through the back, because apparently I'm stupid. And I like to enter through the back door. <laughs> Don't take that out of context. Speed, speed. All right, and down we go. Over here, and nice. Okay, let's grab the valuables one more time. Yeet! All right, we have arrived at our destination. And now, once again, we're just going to deliver our contract, or I guess our valuables. That was really easy. Let's see how much money I was able to make in about 15 minutes of work today. Not even, more like, uh, well, we'll just round it up to 15, but it was probably more like about 12 minutes of work. So if we go onto our phone and we pull out the calculator, we made $125,000 from the first contract, so let's do that. And then we made 85 from the second contract. And then we add on the 85 I made from the security contract. We made $300,000 in about 15 minutes of work. That is a lot of money. That's literally a crazy amount of money for how little we did. If that's 15 minutes work, we multiply it by four. So you'll make about $1.2 million an hour if you do this very simple method. I mean, that's great money. Not to mention, you're also increasing your passive income, which means you can take more money out of this back safe. Look at that. We have $75,000 we can grab right out of the safe for doing nothing. It's just free extra money. If we add on that $75,000, technically that's even more cash. So as always, hope you enjoyed today's video. If you'd like to see more like it, please consider smashing that subscribe button down below, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.